Oh, it depends on the streamer you're watching too, Johnny. Like, Grim's one of the calmest streamers I've ever watched. And he makes SMW look so easy. I shouldn't be alive right now. I should not be alive right now. I should be dead. Oh my god. Oh, I got the checkpoint. Let's go. There's more though. Oh wait. Oh, so one out, two. Okay. I should be I should have been dead there. Dude, I honestly thought that was the end of the level. <laughs> I honestly thought that was the end of the level. Shit. Felt like the end? It did. Whew. By the way, Johnny. What's up with those goddamn fillies? What the heck, Johnny? I told you they need to take two or three from the Pirates and three or four from the Nationals. Or they're dead to me. Especially since the Nationals have no team left next week. Although we have a chance now because now we got rid of Vince Velasquez. Now they have Nola on the mound next. And I think that new pitcher is going to be pitching soon. Yeah. Dude, there's this guy, like, on social media that they were, like, blaming Bryce Harper. The guy fucking walked twice and had two ground outs. I don't know how it's his problem. Did they expect too much from Harper? Nope, they, they weren't throwing Harper any pitches the whole time. Like, Jesus. I'm sick of Herrera, though. I know before I went to bed, Herrera had the bases loaded, and of course, he got out again. He's fucking useless. I wish they would've got a center fielder at the deadline. I think... They might be using Freddy Galvis as a center fielder they were talking about. <laughs> That'd be nice. Put Galvis in the center field, and you got a really good lineup. Ooh. Okay, and then we go... Do we go back there? I think we go back there. His average is so much higher with men on... But yeah. Yeah, it's because he walked... Like, the first two at-bats, he had, like, two pitches to hit, I think. The whole at-bat out of, like, 20 pitches. <laughs> or maybe not that many. But, like, 10 pitches, he had two to hit, you know? And he walked. He ended up walking. And people get upset when he walks. But, like, what are you supposed to do? You can't just go up there and swing at anything. They literally didn't pitch to him at all. I don't blame him either. I think they made a mistake. The lineup was a mistake when they put Real Muto at the leadoff spot. Real Muto needs to be pitching or hitting behind Harper. He's the only guy that can protect Harper. <laughs> Bitch. I wonder if I need to go up there and then go right. Like, go up to the Koopa first. Stuff. Thanks for extending your gifts up through September. And what universe is your catch of? Well, I think Buster Posey used to lead off occasionally. And so did, uh... I'm trying to think here. I think uh, JT Martinez used to as well occasionally for Boston. Even though he was more of a home run hitter. D88 hype. Jesus. What's up, John? Uh, Steph, thanks for the 88 bits. Waking me up. Waking up in the morning, huh? Alright, we're gonna try to go in this Koopa first, right? Like, do this. No, see, I need to go right and then left. Okay, right, left, right. Right, left, right. Okay. There's a few catchers, but there's also catchers that used to be... I think they need to... If they had the DH... Who's yelling? Stay awake. D -D I'm, I am awake. Oh, 
What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> Yo, Steph, thanks for the 88 bits again. The fuck is going on here? This level. Anyway, I was gonna say, Johnny, you know how awesome it would be if the Phillies got, like, if they brought the DH to the NL? Because they have Rio Muto. You can also use Rio Muto as a first baseman, which is nice. Like, they're talking about bringing the DH to the NL next year. That'd be so huge for the Phillies for Rio Muto and Harper. Because then you can play them off the field. I was hoping they would uh, leave the DH when the Phillies had, uh, what's his face from the Mets? The guy that retired. Adam Dunn? Not, not Adam Dunn. It was, uh, what's his name? No, it was, uh, God, why can't I think of his name? Why can't I think of his name? Who'd the Phillies have on their team that was playing as a DH occasionally in the outfield? Whew. This level's hard. Hi, Karumba. Jay Bruce, that's it. Why was I thinking Adam Dunn? They play as teammates, that's why. Jay Bruce. I think he retired. Pretty sure he was retiring. I still think that was a great tier, good trade for the Phillies at the time. Because they didn't have to pay his salary either. Like, most of his salary is paid from the team they traded for. I hit that and then go up and around, I think is what I need to do. Okay, this is hard, man. I still think the trades the Phillies did before the deadline were really good this time, too. The, the trade to, uh... To get a closer and a, and a starting pitcher, it was really good. Even if the closer's old as AF, and the, the starting pitcher's kind of older, but, like, he's going to be there for a couple more years, so that'll be good. And they stayed under the luxury tax, too. Which is also nice, financially. Because then you could spend more next season. Yeah, I don't know if you guys saw, like, the salaries in baseball right now. <laughs> The Yankees and the Dodgers are almost three million, 300 million, wasn't it? Like, they are so far ahead of the rest. It's ridiculous. It's pretty sad for the Yankees. At least the Dodgers are winning championships. The Yankees haven't won, haven't been to the World Series since 2009. The farm system sucks, yeah, same here. Although, I will say I was disappointed when they had to trade Sixto Sanchez away. They get JT, although I, I wanted to get JT and I'd rather, I would have kept the trade anyway. I was just disappointed they had to get rid of him. Even though he's out for the year now, uh, I think he could have been potentially insanely good. Like, he showed potential in his first couple months in the majors. No, it's because they had a horrible GM, but they got rid of him, so I think they're starting to get better now. Some of the prospects they've gotten uh, have been better now. Like, their farm system rankings of the last couple years has gone up a little bit, so... Hopefully. A lot of people are saying the people they drafted in this draft is pretty good, too. One of them's a high school kid, though, so we'll see. Woo, baby! I'm so good at this game. Let's go! Uh-oh. Uh... -oh. uh <laughs> I didn't want to mess that up after saying I was so good at this game. I was like, don't, don't screw it up, Danji. You've come too far. That was a really, really, really fun level. Like, that level was so fun. That was really good. I really enjoyed that level a lot. God, that, that felt so good doing everything in that level. All right, 13th clear. There you go. We're with the elites here. Look at that. Everybody liked it, too. Like, every single clear liked this level. How good was that? 